Hey guys, welcome to another Galaxy Ace tutorial. Uh, so I've had my uh, Cyanogen Mod 7 for a while and uh, I'm getting a bit bored with it. So I'm going to try another ROM called the MUI ROM. And uh, basically the process for installing uh, this ROM, uh, because we've already done most of the hard work in getting the Cyanogen mod up and running so this one will be a lot easier and uh, the first step obviously is to download the zip file for the ROM onto your SD card okay so the uh, web address for getting this ROM I will copy it into the uh, link uh, into the description section of the video so you can just click on the link and download the ROM uh, basically it's down here where it says download so click on that download ROM and then once you have downloaded this file just copy it to your SD card I'm sure you guys know how to do that so I won't go into details for that one Okay, so now that our um, <coughs> MUI ROM is copied onto our SD card, we want to go into our clockwork mod. So press the power button, I mean press the home button downwards. Oops, it's already turned on. Let me just turn that off. Power off your phone. So press down the home button and then press the power button. All the way till you get to the clockwork mod coming up. Okay, so now what you want to do is back up your Cyanogen mod. Right, we did a lot of work to get the Cyanogen mod up and running. If this fails, uh, it'll be pretty stupid to not have it backed up and repeat everything we did in the other video. And that will take probably half a day. So go to Backup and Restore. And press Backup. And it's now backing up your system. So, later on, if what we do doesn't work out, we can just restore the backup and hopefully it'll go back to the Cyanogen mod. So this will probably take about five minutes. <clears throat> okay, now that our backup is complete, uh, it should be safe for us to try and install the new MUI ROM. So click on, uh, hang on a sec, just let me check something. So click on uh, Factory Reset. Um, so wipe data, Factory Reset. Yes, wipe all user data. Okay, now that the data wipe is complete, uh, let's try, uh, where is it, install zip from SD card, uh, choose zip from SD card, and down here you can see the MUI ROM, so click on that, press that, install MUI ROM, okay, now it's installing, Uh, good thing that uh, if it doesn't work, we can simply restore our backup, which is a pretty big possibility. 
since I haven't done this one yet myself. So let's just wait for a couple of minutes, see how it goes. Okay, so now it says that it's complete and uh, I guess all we can do is uh, restart it, press the power button to go backwards and then go to reboot system now and hopefully that might work. And uh, usually when you start a reboot for the first time with a new ROM it'll take a while to open up so wait a couple of minutes and see what happens hey so after waiting for about maybe five to ten minutes uh, it's finally loaded so this is the MUI ROM and uh, scroll down with this so uh, play with the new mod and if you don't like it then feel free to go back to clockwork mod and restore it back to the Sinogen mod. Okay. Uh by um, turning it off again. Oops. and then go to power on uh, and go to backup and restore and if you go to restore that should restore your phone back to Synergen mod uh, I won't restore it just yet, but that's how you do it if you want to try that. Okay, thanks for watching the tutorial. Uh, see you next time.